our social media expert. Hope is back tonight for Tuesday Tips. Thanks so much for being here. Of course. I feel weird saying Happy New Year because it's a little late, but we haven't seen her in a while. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so how's 2024 going so far? Really, really good. Good. Yeah. <laughs> social media hasn't changed too much in the last few months. We're still right. kind of holding on to a lot of the changes that happened in 2023. Mm -hmm. Instagram is really popular because it's kind of, it's easy enough for yeah. people to, to schedule when yep. they're talking about businesses, they yeah. understand it because yep. it's videos and yeah. photos. Yeah. What's working well on Instagram right now? Well, Instagram is like a, an app for connection. There's so many different ways that you can connect with people on Instagram. There's stories, there's reels, there's lives, there's carousel posts. There's so many different aspects of Instagram. So it can be a lot for business yeah. owners to keep up with it. But we have to always remember that it's a storytelling app and it's we are all on social media to connect with people. So what's working well right now is really original content, like content that you yourself create and is specific to you and your brand. Whenever I look at my clients' insights and analytics for what's working right now for them, it's always content that has faces in it. Mm -hmm. It's always content that has the owner of the business at the forefront. They're on video, they're on the stories, they're in the photos as opposed to models in the photos or sure. customers in the photos, which that's all great too. But as often as you can get your people that are a part of your business or your brand, at the forefront of your social media, that's what's gonna work the best. It's so true. When you like meet a, yep. meet a new person yeah. <laughs> on social yeah. media, I'm always scrolling, even if it's a photographer and they have like right. beautiful photos, I'm still like, but where are you? Yes, <laughs> exactly. Because you wanna know who you're talking to. Exactly. Yeah, yep. that is really important. Mm -hmm. Something that you told us is yeah. we shouldn't be afraid of this year. Mm -hmm. I think a lot yeah. of people don't understand. Yes. Repeating, repetitive, tell yes. me about that. So marketing is actually less about finding new things to say all the time and instead finding new ways to say the same thing over okay. and over again. So when you're a business or you're building a brand, you should try to think of three to five things that you're known for. You can call it like a power statement. So what are the myths that you want to bust about your industry? What are the things that really set you apart from anybody else, from the millions and millions of other people on Instagram? Sure. And think of those three to five statements that you can constantly cycle through and repeat in your content. People do not remember what you shared yesterday. They do not remember what you shared a month ago or even a year ago. Um, so you need to repeat yourself often as a business owner. That's and you can't know. be afraid of that. I, I think new research shows that you have to have like over 20 touch points with somebody okay. before they finally decide to make a purchase. Yeah. So think about sharing your offer, you know, in fresh new ways and, and putting yourself out there um, in new ways all the time, of course, but finding new ways to say the same few yeah. things and not be afraid sense. to cycle through those things that you want to be known for. Yeah, because you want to be known for, you know, your thing. Right. And so when someone needs you or wants your service, they're like, oh yeah, because she's told me like 10 times. I know it's <laughs> exactly. hope. <laughs> Follow Hope on social media, that'll help you. You see what she does and see how she repurposes her content or says the same thing in a different way. Yes. Uh, you can follow Hope on Instagram, on Facebook, She Communications. Reach out to her and you can scan that flow code for more info too. Thanks for coming in, it's good to see you. Thanks for having me. We'll be right back with another GDS Weekly Teacher Check-In. Don't go anywhere.